streets of town. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so. Sort of the way that Lancaster's the, the uni has changed over the time you've been away. Uh, interestingly, if you walk up the middle, which is all that was here when I was a student, it's not changed. Mm -hmm. It's rather like the centre of Rome. There are no new buildings because it's full of old ones. Yeah. And the campus is full of old buildings. So in a sense, it's not changed. Mm -hmm. But of course, if you walk on the outside, then you see it has changed plentifully. Yeah. Uh, and it's in the park didn't exist back in the day. So Grise um, and Pendle at the end of the world. <laughs> If you wanted to go down, it. When you were at Lancaster Uni studying, uh, sort of what was your highlight? Is there any sort of memory that sticks out from being at university? Uh, so many, and it's impossible really to single anyone out. Um, I was particularly proud, I think, of my performance in Eight Songs from Mad King with Peter Maxwell Davis music theatre piece. Um, not given to everybody to do it, but we did it, and it was sort of, sort of a triumph. And so I enjoyed that. In fact, I prized that performance at the Coliseum when I started singing there. So that remains a sort of my life. And learning to cook. <laughs> yes, yeah, true. I hope you have a good day. Thank, Thank you very much for talking to us. Not at all. Um, nice to meet you. Thank you. Ciao. Cheers.